Vidro College, Grade 1, Computer Studies, Part of a Computer. Parts of the computer, Lesson 2, Input, Process, Output. Hello, my dear children. How are you all? I am your computer teacher. As you have a long vacation, I am here to teach you another lesson about computer. Are you all ready? As you have learned about parts of the computer, I hope you can remember them. Isn't it? Let's revise it quickly. Parts of the computer. CPU, monitor, keyboard, mouse, speakers, printer. When all these parts get together, it is a computer. Okay children, now you can remember the parts of the computer. Let me ask you a few riddles about the uses of them. Number one, it helps us to listen to music. What is it? Speakers. Number two, it helps us to print letters. What is it? Printer. Very good. We can take printouts using the printer. Number three, it helps us to enter data. What is it? Keyboard. The keyboard helps us to type letters, numbers or words. Number four. It helps us to choose things in the monitor. What is it? Mouse. It helps us to click. Number five. It looks like a television. What is it? Monitor. Monitor has a screen like the television. Very good, my. Well done, my dear children. I hope you can remember the previous lesson now. Parts of the computer. Now, I am going to teach you the new lesson today. Are you all ready? Now we are about to make the delicious cake. Have you seen your parents making cake? Well, I have seen my mother making cake. She uses different items to make it. So, today I am going to show you how to make a yummy cake. I hope you will enjoy. The things we add to make the cake is called input. Butter, egg, coloring, flour, sugar. If you want to make it yummy, you can add some chocolate powder too. Well now, we need to mix them up. And then it is the process. To bake the cake, we use the oven. The oven starts processing. The output is a delicious cake. Mmm, it looks yummy, isn't it? Did you enjoy it? Now you all know how to make a cake. You can make a cake at home with your parents. Such as the cake, a computer also has input, process, output. I will show you what they are. 
You all know that computer has different parts. Some parts help us to enter data or information into the computer. The brain of the computer, CPU, helps to process. And finally, the result shows using some other parts. I'll show them now. Input Mouse Keyboard these parts help us to enter data by typing letters, numbers, words using the keyboard or by clicking using the mouse. Process CPU CPU helps to process the information. Output Monitor printer, speakers. These parts help us to find the result has image, document, or sound. I will show you an example. A boy is using the mouse and the keyboard to search a picture, so he uses the input devices. And then he wants to take the picture out from the computer. For that, the CPU starts processing and then we get the output by the printer. We call them printouts. Here are some inputs and outputs. Dirty clothes. I want to wash these dirty clothes. How can I do it? What do I need? Washing machine. That's great. The washing machine start to process and we get the output as clean clothes. Next we have petrol. What can I do with petrol? Who needs petrol? Vehicles. Very good. Vehicles start to process by petrol and the output is we can drive it. I hope you enjoyed the lesson. Let me see whether you can remember it. Name two input devices Mouse Keyboard Very good! Name three output devices Monitor Printer and speakers. Very good. Well done, my dear children. That's all for today. I hope you will revise this lesson again and again. Until the next time. Goodbye. Hope to see you soon. Stay safe.